All right, quest. When we got sand, but oh, okay. Cushioning. <laughs> That's sad. That Lodgok died. He was really bringing it to me, too. Ooh! I do require a whooper. Rebellion. Come back. Come back. Revelio. Not the green one. I need a different color. I found a gold Niffler earlier, Cameron. I thought he was like t-shirt, but then I realized he was more yellow and I was like, ooh. So he's... He's chilling in there somewhere. One of my vivariums. I reorganized my uh, room when I got the last vivarium. Um, currently, I think all the birds, except for the hippogriffs, are in... Um, the fourth one. No, in the second one. And then I've got the Phoenix, the Nifflers, and the Hippogriffs in the fourth one. And then I put I put the Neasles in the first one with the Puff Skeens and uh Dang it. This stupid mountain. Nifflers! Taking their money. Alright, just get me back to Hogwarts. I guess I don't have to go through the mountain. I need to sell things. Take me to Lower Hogsfield. I think I can sell to that guy there. I wonder who lives here. You know who lives here. You've met people. One of the students who saved little Archie Bickle from Hello, Mr. Semi. I am what indeed. Can I do for you? What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? Ah, yes, a wonderful choice. 
Do I need these? No. Do I need this? No. Do I need this? Maybe. Do I need this? No. Do I need this? No. Do I need this? No. 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 I'm not selling that. I don't really know. I guess I could sell it. That's true, I can just put better traits on my current one. Thank you, good sir. I hope to see you again sometime. worried. She said Sebastian promised her that I would be there if she went to meet him in the catacomb. But now he's asking her to join him immediately and to come alone. She says he doesn't sound himself. Meet us at the catacomb as soon as you can. I hope that my quill has made my message clear. <laughs> the frick was that ghost lady's problem? Yeah, I agree. <laughs> Sebastian would be big worrying me right now. The question is... Oh my god. Yeah, that was the question. Rewards Havada Kedavra. Oh god, I... This is about to be rough, isn't it? This is about to be real bad. <laughs> oh no. Hey, at least I'll have it in the Ranrock fight. If it makes me mad enough, I might actually use it. I know that's the cheap way to end the boss, but after, you know, he just killed my man Lodgok. So. You didn't have it. You would have. <laughs> no, I'll probably try several times to do it without Avada. But if we have another Callisto Protocol situation going on on our hands, where I'm there for like hours, unable to complete it, I'm definitely using it. I can't have 50 Wigan Weld, I can only have 25. Thanks. Professor Fig got my owl. I need to tell him and the keepers that Ranrock knows where the last repository is. Yeah. I imagine it is just an extremely hard fight. Ranrock is moving more it seems like it would be. Anticipated. This is grave news indeed. 
We had hoped for more time to discuss the way the I've heard you talk forward. about it. I know you're not just uh, trash it on my skill. Granted, my skill is kind of trash sometimes, most of the time, but Professor, you received my owl. Ranrock has the last of Bragpool's journals. He killed Lodgok to get it. He knows where the last repository is. Godric's heart. Lodgok. Lodgok and Ranrock were brothers. Lodgok was bringing the journal to me. Ranrock is a monster. We need to know where the final repository is. It's true, and hard mode's not fun. I mean, it is fun, but it's very Surely tough. This changes things. Ranrock has Bragbor's journals and knows where the final repository is. We obliviated Bragbor. He kept journals? Why would he have documented all of this? He didn't know what we were containing. Did Isidora tell him? Isidora told Bragbor about the magic when she asked him to build a container for her. That's right. I've seen her Yes, memories. I did see Isidora that memory. left memories for someone to find? You know what she did? Her memories showed what she did for her father, which I also saw in Professor Rookwood's pensive. And a conversation with Bragbor in which she expressed frustration about the limits being placed on her use of ancient magic. Based upon the memories they have seen, I believe our young friend is well aware of the grave circumstances in which we find ourselves. The next trial will involve an exceptional level of magical skill and a new <laughs> ability to Facts. interact with beasts. Interact with beasts. Find a face of stone and tendrils. I should advise you that you must engage with any beast that is part of the trial on your own. Professor Bakar will meet you in his pensive room. What do you mean you forgot about this trial? You said it was easy, Cameron. Nuanced ability to interact with beasts? Hmm. I suppose we should begin our search for a face of stone and tendrils. Whatever that may be. Very well. Professor Weasley has been keeping an eye on me. Perhaps we should meet there, so she has no reason uh. to raise concerns with Professor okay. Black. I shall see you near the coast. Perhaps then you can tell me a little more about the memories of Isadora that you witnessed. It's okay, I understand. I do like Beast though, so maybe it won't be so bad. Unless, of course, it's, you know, the beast I don't like. <laughs> oh, Ignatia. Did you ever go in the kitchens? This isn't the kitchens. Where am I at? I guess that was only part of the Gryffindor side quest. It's right next to your common room. Why is it always in the south? Can it never be in the north? I would have zero things marked over there, wouldn't I? I'm trying to think. If I go here. Yeah, I'm definitely fast traveling. I'm just trying to figure out which one's closest. It's probably this one. Not that one? What are you up to now? That's the closest one I had. That also wasn't surrounded by mountains. Oh. Good point. I didn't see this one.
Which one did you mean then? Revelio. What's up, poachers? Rash winders, one of the two. I'm concerned you're already getting popcorn. Well, I don't want to see what these beasts are over here. Oh, just these jobber knolls. Yeah. I do consider myself pretty good with beasts, so maybe this won't be so bad. I've always said that travel broadens the You're here. What's up, my I man? Have good news. Rebellion. We do not have any of Ranrock's loyalists to contend with. Of course, because they no longer need to track the keepers for information. Is that a? It is. I believe I know what must be done. Do you recognize the head sculpted there? Dragon. That's a head. I can't say that I do. Well, it's obviously a head, stupid. Beast known as a grap horn. And the prints carved into the ground lead me to believe that a grap horn will somehow open the way forward. That's what Professor Rackham meant when he spoke of my needing an ability to interact with beasts. It would seem so. I do know that the last of a long dynasty of grap horns lives nearby. They call him the Lord of the Shore. What? I suspect you'll need to bring him here. What happens next, I can't say. Great. Have you ever subdued a grap horn, Professor? I have, yes. Years ago, at Stonehenge, of all places. The Ministry still owes me for that favor. It can be difficult, of course. They are massive, after all. But it's not impossible. It's my experience that many of your spells will have no real effect. You'll need to wear him down. What do you mean by that? must be done. I'll do it. Excellent. I know this area well enough. When you see the remains of a large sea creature, you're in the right place. Now, Professor Rackham made it clear that you must engage with any beast that is part of this trial on your own. Why, though? So, I shall wish you good luck and wait for your return in the map chamber. In the map chamber? Why are you going back to the map chamber? Why can't you just stand right here? Or you can't, or is, am I about to start the trial and you're just not going to be here at all? Is that... Time for a jaunt, I'd say. All the way over there. Lord of the Shore is a pretty dope name. Hey yo, you seen Lord of the Shore? Slow down now. There we go. Hey. Hey. Actually, can this guy see me uh, on Eighth Astral, or does he think I'm just sitting on the air? Do do do. He did look like Sebastian's uncle. This looks intriguing. 
I don't know what saw me, but I'm just going to keep moving. Uh, I could have flown. I just wanted to ride. I haven't been to this area, so I wanted to look around. I saw a dragon earlier. Animals. Puff skins. Go. Go. Well, there's the corpse of an animal. You need to race though, my friend. This must be the place. Well, the map is telling me that there's a path over here and I shouldn't just walk off. Extreme danger. Is he going to attack me? He's not as kind as the other breedable or gettable animals, is he? And I'll do that Merlin trial later. Hello. Very well, Lord of the Shore. Show yourself. Hello. Oh my god. Oh my god. That hurts. Am I actually supposed to hurt this guy? Because, like... I don't want to, like, hurt him if I'm not supposed to hurt him. But I get the feeling I'm about to really need to hurt him. Okay. Alright. But I actually have to hurt him. Please stay stuck over there. That's a barrel.
yeah. I heard him coming too late. One of these is going to work well on him. Maybe not have the same one. Are you angry? Oh god. I just looked up a very angry man. Or woman. Get up, get up. I'm just not good at dodging him right now at all. Oh my god! Come on. I'm out of Wigan Weld. I'm drowning now. I'm probably dead now. No, I'm not. So, somehow. Don't be dead right there! God! Uh, if that, if my last spell I cast had to reacted any quicker, it would have been done. 
the whole battle over again? Oh my god. Okay. Does another one of these spells work at all? I that one might. I I don't want to unforgivable him. That would just be rude. Glacius does nothing. Okay, I'm doing a lot better. I've got a lot more Wigan Weld this time around than I did the first time. Because now I know what spells actually work on this guy. And it's literally all the damage spells. Assign. I don't know how to dodge that, because I did what I usually works. Okay. Yeah, that was... I just didn't dodge that time. I'm under him. Oh my god. There we go.
Oh, thank God the how to train your dragon option worked. I think. I need your help, friend. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Faster. Airborne is powerful charge attack that deals a large amount of damage to enemies and certain barricades. Hold L2 to initiate. Keep an eye on the Graphorn stamina meter as charging will drain it. Is this the How to Train Your Dragon music? Faster. Poachers. Let's see how the Lord of the Shore feels about his neighborhood being invaded. See ya! That's definitely the How to Train Your Dragon music. Excuse me, sir. I would be horrified watching a random student pull up on this. Lame. Let my man come see the memory with me. Yeah, that was definitely my favorite trial. Revelio. 
That was kind of hard, but it was a lot of fun. Perhaps Professor Rockham was right to have had faith in you. You think? I still have my reservations. Isadora, as you will see, was not who she seemed. I can only hope that you are. Bro, I'm just my here for animals and my friends. Any That's questions it. Questions you may have about the power you will need to protect. Thank you, Professor Bakar. I shall see you back in the map chamber. I'm just here for my friends and my animals, so whatever is best for them is what I will do. That's it. Rebellion. Bro, your memory chamber sucks. There wasn't a... What do you mean? I was there for Sebastian. But the one time I let him torture me, not thinking, I... Was it a bad thing I didn't want to- I didn't want my friend to have to go through all the pain and torture of being tortured by the torture curse? It was not being selfish. I didn't want him to have to go through that pain. I just was not thinking about, you know, Hello. exactly what would happen. Isadora? We don't know that. Uh oh. <laughs> Mr. Morgan, like I. Hello, Mr. Morganock. Mr. Morgan. He's fine. Son, I'm glad you're here. Isadora was not at her home. I know. Her father... Percival... What is it? It is as though he was stripped not only of his pain, but of all emotion. Everything mm. is much worse than I feared. Neve was right. Isadora hasn't stopped. I've just learned that she has been wielding that magic on students. Mmm. That's not good. We must gather the others. As, as a current education major, you should not uh, perform experimental magic on your students. I need you to return to your common room, all right? That kid's like, yeah, whatever. Okay. I don't know what's going on. A repository. What have you done? Take a breath. She's insane. Students, Isadora. Everyone feels pain. And why? Because of your arrogance? Your obsession with secrets? He won't suffer any longer. Not my father. Not my students. No one. Isadora. Set. Down your wand. Professor, you taught me to hone my power, not throw it away. I did not teach you this. Expelliarmus! Oh boy, I suddenly really don't want to fight Renrock. Over the 
Кедавра! Holy crap. I guess. Yeah, <laughs> my cloak is in front of my pants. Well, like this game took a really, really dark turn all of a sudden. No wonder I didn't like Bakar. He straight up killed her. I mean, granted, granted, he wasn't. That wasn't entirely an unreasonable thing to do. And I guess at this point they weren't unforgivable, so you know what? It's all right. The caverns below Hogwarts, where you fought Isadora, is that the location of the final repository? It is. You see, we could not destroy the strands of emotion Isadora had stolen from so many. So we did all that we could to keep them safe. So Renrock is coming here. That until they could be destroyed. The magic used to create them was a danger to wizard kind. Hence, we became keepers. Keepers of an unfathomable secret. We knew that someday, one with the ability to see traces of ancient magic might be seduced by its power. We built the trials to lead that person to us. To allow them to prove themselves worthy of the knowledge we'd kept hidden and the responsibility that accompanies it. Have I not proven myself, Professor? I need to get to that repository before Ranrock does. You have, and you will. But the repository is protected by powerful ancient magic. To enter, you must craft a special wand from the four artifacts you found above our Aww, pensives. Like my so wand. The repository is safe from Ranrock for now. If he is, as you suspect, capable of using the power of the other repository, I fear he will be able to breach our defenses. Then I of course! Craft this wand. Perhaps Mr. Ollivander will help me. Another Ollivander? I'm not surprised. As I am sure he will tell you, this wand may be used for only one purpose. Return with the wand, and we will open the way forward. I shall send an owl ahead to Ollivander. Whilst you visit him, I'll reach out to Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley? Yes. I may have made an error in judgment by not informing her of Ranrock's intentions earlier. Yeah. I only hope it's not too late. If Ranrock really is going to try to drill below Hogwarts, we'll need all the help we can get. It's all true. Professor. We're going to war! Soon. A very, very dangerous war. We're getting our own Battle of Hogwarts. I'm excited.